Well, it looks like the praying mantises chief of staff ran a $1 million slush fund by diverting cash to his own companies. Now, this is in the Washington Examiner. Two political action committees founded by the Praying Mantis's top aide funded over $1 million in political donations into two of his own private companies, according to a complaint filed with the Federal Election Commission on Monday. The cash transfers from the PACs overseen by Sakiat Shakat Fafi, the freshman Socialist Democrat Chief of Staff, run counter to the Praying Mantis's pledges to increase transparency and reduce the influence of dark money in politics. Shaka Bratis companies appear to have been set up for the sole purpose of obscuring how the political donations were used. Well, it looks like the pesticides are coming after the praying mantis. Thank God for the Washington Examiner and its courage to report the story. I'm going to have the link down here in the description. Uh, but it's it's good. And, uh, you know, the praying mantis should be exposed for what they are and who they are. Okay, with that, we will see you in the next clip. Oh, wait a minute. The complaint names the praying mantis and shikari as respondents. It asks the FEC to investigate the audit and the two PACs, saying they were engaged in an elaborate scheme to avoid proper disclosure of campaign expenditures. Oh, this is a good one. This is a good one. Let's see. He founded the PAC called the Brand New Congress in 2016 and another called Justice Democrats in 2017 with the stated goal of helping to elect progressive candidates to Congress. One of those candidates was the Praying Mantis, who last November, at age 29, became the youngest member ever to be elected to Congress. This is a great story by the Washington Examiner. And again, uh, as I said before, I'm going to have the link. And uh, we will see you in the next clip.